my team has been secretly grinding the heck out of hardcore group Iron Man while leaks was going on. And when I mean my team, I mean Mr. Fuse. Mr. Fuse was the only one out of us three, uh, me and Mutz, that didn't play leaks. And so he got us so far ahead in the rankings that by the time I came back uh, to playing the normal accounts, uh, no Iron Man and my Harper Group Iron Man, we were already almost to rank one. So I just leveled a little bit to contribute, but honestly, Fuse is absolutely killing it. Look at us now. Rank one in the skilling high scores for Hardcore Iron Man Trio Group. That's right, we have eclipsed the three fat virgins from their former rank one spot. And Robot Mafia is kind of closing in on us, but uh, that's okay, you know? I'm just happy to say that we were rank one, at least at some point in our lives, rank one. And I'll show you what I mean by Fuse carrying us, because uh, you will notice that Mr. Fuse has uh, 110 million experience, 1900 total, while well, I me mean, Mutz have uh, 18 to 1700 total, only 70 mil experience, right? The Fuse man going hard. We're gonna hear a few words from the man himself about his progress in a second, and I'll show you some of his highlights. But please, please, if you love hardcore group Iron Man content, you must support my man Fuse, okay? You can do so by a few things. You can subscribe to his channel. Look at his face, so cute. So cute and adorable. Click on that bell, subscribe, okay? All right, shout Fuse, okay? This man single-handedly carried us and gave me so much motivation to continue back. And also, he has a Twitch as well. There it is, Twitch link as well. Twitch.tv slash Fuse. Follow his ass, okay? If you want to drop a sub too, drop a sub, you know? That'd be great as well. All right, anyways, you will hear from him now. Yo, trying to give a rundown of what I've been doing. Uh, we do have disgusting total level 1915. I've just been skilling a bunch. We got 92 wood cutting just from AFKing. Uh, 98 mage, almost 99. We'll probably get that just from raids um, or just telling from corp because you got to do a lot of tellies. Uh, we will get construction uh, to 83 for an pool and we'll get crafting the 93 for tortures for the team. And herbal is going to stay the same for a while because there's no point because Mutz already has uh, almost 90. Um, but yeah, that's the uh, total level right now. Just like over, uh, like overhealing food. I love it. Oh my god. Yo, yo. A quick word from our supportive sponsors. I was introduced to a really chill game recently that has versions on both the PC and phone. It is called Hero Wars. It has a very slick and easy to understand UI, so you can't really miss out on the various content from PvE to PvP. I also found the beginning tutorial very easy to follow and I actually enjoyed it. I felt compelled to level up my characters and wanted to upgrade stats and gear through the monster battles that you can engage in. It's also very AFK, which is perfect for something to do on the side to keep you busy. It also has a nice progression ladder where every 10 levels you reach on your team allows access to different kinds of content from expeditions similar to raids to massive PvP tournaments called Arena and Grand Arena. Hero Wars does have a big social media following of over 4 million players to help you learn and master the 50 plus different heroes for any of the modes. And this game has over 130 missions for you to explore and beat. Join the game now and get a super chest with a secret hero as well as 600 emerald and 30,000 gold. Scan this QR code or download the game from the link below the video description. See you in the game. Primordial crystal boys, first one. Let's go. I mean, I don't have the runecraft. Yeah, no, I don't. Have, I'm pretty sure it's 60, right? I thought I just ate the primordial crystal into the ashes. Yeah, I need 60 runecrafting. 78 KC boys. I am so happy. Uh, refresh the stream t-shirt. Oh my god! No! 435 KC, dude. Oh my god. Yes! I'm finally lucky in this on a stupid ass account. Let's go. Bro, my team's gonna be so happy. Let me tell- Oh, oh, oh they're not online. Dude! Yes! Yes, man. Oh my god, that's so good. Yes, they're gonna be so happy. I'll, I'll DM them on Discord then. I've just been AFK anglers and fossil island crabs, but these will come in really handy for sure when I actually can play a lot of Parkour Group Iron Man 2000 anglers, because um, Mr. Fuse and Mutz will be playing a bit more than I am. 
Hey yo boys, now that we're back, the group armor content is steamrolling. But there's already so much in this video that I decided it's good to let you guys consume what we have here, digest, and you can watch the next one. But if you guys really want another one, get a thousand likes on this video and I'll put it out in the next three days. The return of the hardcore group Iron Man. Except I will not be tanking Bandos this time because I just got back from Leagues and the Leagues is such a different playstyle, especially with the Knife's Edge being low HP. I do not want to risk accidentally getting these weird muscle memories where I don't eat up. So we'll let the experienced hardcore group Iron Man player, Mr. Fuse, do that since he's been playing the hardcore group Iron Man the whole time. So better safe than sorry. And also my stats are quite a lot better. I'm almost base 90 melee. It's just been IFKing fossil crabs as much as I can. Quick recap at Bandos. We have one Bandos God Sword, uh, two Bandos chest plates, and two Bandos tacits. And our main goal is to get a second Bandos God Sword. A second Bandos God Sword would mean that each of us will have a defense reduction weapon, two BGS, and one Warhammer. So that's core. Getting an extra Tacit and an extra BCP would be nice though too as well, so long term we want those as well. But yeah, the main goal is the BGS so we can do Corp nicely and uh, make Raids 1 and eventually TLB more efficient. I'm gonna eat up here. What the hell? I got a curved bone? No, from freaking Bandos. <laughs> That's not me. Oh, Tacit! Oh my god. Oh my god, yo, yo, Tacits, let's go, that's the third one, that's the third one, baby. Oh, BGS into the Debo, right there, you saw that, that was perfect, lowered it just enough for the Debo to probably land. Oh, yo, uh, server? Oh shit, oh. You tell it? I know, I know, no, no, that's smart. Huh, <laughs> cake. <laughs> yeah, nice, nice and tango, dude. <laughs> Holy shit, Mutt's monitor DC'd? <laughs> what the hell, dude? A uh, freaking Mutt's monitor DC'd. So I don't know exactly what he did or how he fixed it, but uh, we couldn't really PVM together for like two days, three days, because uh, yeah, it just kept happening and uh, eventually he found a way to fix it. Damn, three bandos trips in three days with no drops. Sad. Unfortunate. Some tree of BCP. No, I got a, we got that a long time ago. Oh. <laughs> Come back. Ouch. I'm eating. Oh, we got it. Oh my god. 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 We actually did it. Yo, teleport. Yo, get out. Get out. Pick it up. Pick it up. Oh, I mean, oh, dude. Yo, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, I almost used all my hard food for that kill. <laughs> you need a BCP now when we're good. Thank, but. thank God. You yeah, yeah. Third uh, BCP would be banging, dude. Oh, that's actually man. So, oh, I guess that's all right, that's we got to go for the back to back. I, I'll, I'll brew yeah, it up yeah, if yeah, I have yeah. to. The back to back. Back to back. back, to back? Yo, back to back. Wait, wait, you guys said back to back. Oh, oh wait, no, I'm trolling. No, 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 no. no yeah. No, no. We're, we're taking the back to back. Yeah, yeah, we should yeah. take a break from Mandos. I'm kind of tired of being here, dude. <laughs> oh, give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Oh, ho, ho, look at that. We're like so close to top. Look at this. <laughs> you were Two stacked. and a Warhammer. Oh, that is nice. That is nice. If Let's we could get some... If we can get like augury or something or or some claws from chambers that'd be super nice too. yeah true claws would be so good for a tia yeah what else do you think we need for uh for uh mm. the good old top like thinking uh, maybe a crystal halley or something yeah, yeah. Crystal crystal halley, halley for sure yeah, that's a must that. yeah one i don't know fuses used to void i believe right yeah maybe maybe get oh dude yo <laughs> maybe get like 93 crafting so you can make some tortures too Honestly, yeah, that would be yeah. Yeah, sure. like a torture would be good too. Honestly, do you need like the bracelet for maging or not? I mean, eh, it's not really necessary. It would it would help, but it's not like actually necessary. Like freeze mm, rolls okay. are pretty sub, you know, sub sub uh priority. 
Like, we shouldn't run out of food. It's more so, basically, we have to kill it faster, so we, do, we reduce the chance of getting yeah. killed. Yeah. Yeah. If we don't have three torches, maybe one of us could run a bluff here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we do that. Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. Pro yeah, we probably can't get three torches on time. It might take a while. Mm -hmm. But yeah, some raids, get something from there. Maybe upgrade jewelry. Get the crystal howley, and that's top. I think that's top ready, I guess. Yeah, as long as you have to make yourself a barrage, you should be good. Yeah, I also need to train my mage. Yeah, I'll, I'll FK some Slayer mage, I guess. Yeah. yeah you guys yeah, got yeah. some extra chaos runes for me uh, or whatever? I'll take them. <laughs> yeah, I think you should have a bunch of views, right? From Hydra. Do I have 25.6k chaos? What the? Okay, oh. yeah, hit me up. I actually have 10k. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna FK train some magic, I guess. I need to get, I need to get, I need to get actually higher than that. Um, it is in. Because uh, the in. boss might drain my stats. Put, uh, yeah. Put 50k in. Yeah, I might need a bit higher, to be honest, than 94. In case my stats get drained and stuff. But I should be Divine mm -hmm. Magic. Though. Yeah, we'll talk more about it, I guess, as we practice. So there's been a massive change, or quality of life, you could say, to group Ironman. Particularly hardcore group Ironman. There's some for group Ironman in general, but the main one I want to talk about is the teleport options that will now be available in places that you normally cannot teleport in two fashions. One is called the Escape Crystal. So this was the crystal originally used for TOB that you can buy and teleport out of TOB. You could not use anything else to teleport out of TOB before. But they expanded the idea of the crystal and called it the Escape Crystal. Now you can use that to teleport out of Pest Control, Inferno, uh, Six Jad Challenge, Chambers, Theater of Blood, Barbarian Assault. Where, yeah, those are dangerous for hardcore groups. So you can actually teleport out of that. If you're feeling like something bad's gonna happen or you're lagging potentially, um, etc., that's absolutely huge. You could really save yourself uh, many, many times over with this ability. So we will be 100% taking advantage of that. And also, they expanded the Ring of Life function for the hardcore group Ironmans as well. Ring of Life can trigger in a lot of places that normally wouldn't, like Fight Caves and the Inferno and stuff like that, too. And also, for the Escape Crystals, if you're doing team content, Another team member on the hardcore group could use it on a team member to teleport themselves out just in case, say, IDC, but one of my teammates didn't, and then they can use it on me to teleport me out, which is absolutely massive because DCs are probably the main killers right now. Escape Crystal. 75k. Uh, uh, it's worth it. I'll, I'll buy 10 of these. <laughs> there we go. Now I can use it for chambers to teleport out too. Oh, <laughs> uh, Toggle. There we go. Let other players rescue me. Oh, that's lit. Uh, just in case I DC, I can save a homie. Damn, that's going to make this so much more better, dude. Holy crap. Honestly. So we decided to give Fuse the best magic equipment so that he can be our main major for Ohm. But the problem is, first raid back, he forgot to charge his trident, so he's pretty useless as a mage. Give me that call back. <laughs> you poor purple? What, 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 what? Good luck. <laughs> Look, look. Oh, oh, oh my god! No way! Oh, that's huge! Dude! Dude, what? Dragon Hunter crossbow! Dude! Dragon Hunter crossbow! Dude! No. Oh. dude. oh my god, dude! You guys oh are gonna do. You guys god. are gonna do Dragon Slayer two or Dragon Hunter crossbow, way? boys? How about that? You can do Dragon Slayer two. What the fuck? Are you crazy? Oh yeah, yo, Fuse, take your uh, take the occult back too. Okay. Dang, yo, upgrade from the rune crossbow? Feels good, man. <laughs> uh, so only Mutz has a really good range weapon. Us, two, Fuse, and me has just Blowpipe and RCB, and it's not that great at Foss anymore, those two weapons. Unless we lower the defense, so that's what we do. We send one person in the front to take the initial damage, and then we go and save him and spec the boss down on the way, lowers the fence, and the Blowpipe will start hitting. Landed. Oh, huge, 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 huge. Yeah, huge. I'll go. You you guys can just uh, do your thing. Oh, here we go. That's the strat, baby. Yeah, it's the fence should still be pretty low. Because, like, we, we lowered it super hard. Yo, dude, this is too easy. No more switching, dude. <laughs> this is too free, man. Yeah, especially with the thralls. It's like two people hitting the mage hand. Yeah, it's almost guaranteed that the head will turn. So free. And it's so much easier too. Yeah, honestly. Yeah, we accidentally like noticed it that one time and now it's like a 
a thing. Now it's the method. <laughs> I call it in uh, the wise words of Fuse, the juice. <laughs> like literally the moment I go under 80, I'm, I'm straight eaten. Oh, we got a purple. Yo. Yo, 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 yo. Yo, yo, wait. What is it? Bro, hold on. Dude, yo, you didn't close the chat. No, dude. Oh, what? Why did you close the chat? You're trolling. Ancestral <laughs> 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 hat, dude. <laughs> oh, my oh, yo, isn't that our first purple it. lol? I mean, my first purple, sorry. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that was your first purple. Well, I already, I already yeah, knew we... it was Ancestral piece because you kind of I'm not using that it. for Zora. Fuck that. Hey. Hey. So dude, I, you, oh. dude, I would bring it here. That's a that's like probably a max yeah, hit. Yeah. Oh, yeah, true. <laughs> yeah. Actually, yeah. Could have been yeah, I'd probably ditch the tone of water then and bring this instead. <laughs> yep. Yeah. This is we can hide next time if you want. Then, uh, it's, it's so funny. I just know Fuse won't hide it. So yeah, oh, come on, Fuse. Oh, Why won't oh, you yeah. hide that? Okay, fine, 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 fine. So we already have an instance of having to use the escape crystal uh, following last week's update. But this thing is super good. As you can see, I can teleport out in the middle of raids where you normally cannot do that. But for the hardcore group, it is a very, very nice uh, item to have just in case DCs. Uh, or things go wrong like this. We just had a really bad uh, setup issue trying to set up a new strategy and we need a bit more practice. But yeah, with this, it's so nice. Instead of having to leave the CC and potentially wait like a few seconds to get kicked off, I can instantly click and insta teleport out. So nice. Okay, I'm gonna have to tell it. Ah, uh, yeah, we fucked that one up so bad. Not yet, not yet, not yet. More and more. We need to down the mage more. <laughs> Yeah, we need down the mage a bit more. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, we're going. Yep, there we go. Uh, 